Hi everybody, this is Matt. Thanks for watching and welcome back. I was talking to a gentleman the other day that had just gotten back into the shooting sports and he was in quite a quandary because he had some 22 LR that had been sitting in his, in his garage for only five years. Only five years. And he went to go out and shoot and basically half of them were duds. He asked me why and I explained to him that where we live it can be an extremely humid environment, especially in the summertime, and moisture is not our friend when it comes to 22LR and storing it. So the best way of preserving your 22LR is to A, get an ammo can. Now there are plastic ones available, but what you want to really look for is you want to look for the ones that have the seal across the top. Now me being old school, I like the original GI US cans, you know, the metal ones, because the metal ones were designed for ammo, they've got a great seal on the top of them, and they can be had for really, really reasonable prices. Plus, you can normally store more in those than you can the plastic ones. So you go ahead and you put your 22LR in there. However, you still have moisture in the air and there's moisture in the containers that the 22LR came up. The, uh, the cardboard has moisture in it. So the other thing that you need to do is you need to draw the moisture out and the best way to do that is desiccant, desiccant dryers. Now you can get packs, but unfortunately desiccant packs sometimes people want a heck of a lot of money for them. And I'm going to show you kind of a different approach. And the moment that I headed downstairs, uh, somebody said to me, okay, MacGyver, what are you doing? Well, here, I'm going to share some knowledge with you. We're going to take commercial desiccant dryer, which is this, which is good enough for a 30 gun gun safe. We're going to use this. We're going to use a plain old pill bottle a coffee filter and a hair tie and I'm going to show you how to make your own desiccant that is reusable so here we go the great thing about this commercial desiccant is it's available for around $15 at your local gun shop or your big box store but what's even better about it is this stuff is reusable you can take this pour it out onto a cookie sheet and then essentially bake the moisture out of it in your oven and it's good to go. It's completely reusable. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this. I'm going to take just a regular pill bottle and just dip it right down into there. And so as you can see, I've got the pill bottle a little bit more than half full. And now I'm going to remove this take the coffee filter, put it over the top, like so, take the hair tie, come around, and then we're going to end up securing this. I'm going to come down here. All right, we're going to secure this just by looping it over. And the thing is, this is permeable enough that it's going to allow the moisture to pass through it and boom, you can just literally take this then and dump it in an ammo can. If you're not too uh, thrilled with this and you think it looks a little bit on the ugly side, all you have to do is you just take a pair of scissors and you can make it look prettier just by going around it and cutting it like so and that's all it takes so this is good to go it doesn't take up hardly any space in the ammo can and it'll work and the great thing is it is reusable you can just go ahead and and treat many 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 ammo cans with one of these so wasn't that simple it doesn't look pretty, but I'll tell you what, it works and it saves you a lot of money. So one of these can treat a lot of ammo cans. And like I said, it's reusable, so it's good stuff. I hope that, uh, that this helps you out. 
And until next time, everybody take care, be safe out there, and have a good one. Also, keep your powder dry.